right, welcome back, lunatics. We are still playing Castle Crashers. Badly. Poorly, <laughs> yes. We're not good. You we have know. potions. We're doing right. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. That's a lot of arrows. Uh... Yeah. I think there's a spot in the middle where you don't get, don't get hit. Seems to be the case. So don't, don't hit them, just walk by them. They freak out. Oh. Still wanted to kill him. Um, yeah. So, have either... I don't think Steven has, because I've talked to him about it a little bit already. Have you seen the new Bo Burnham special yet? No, I have not. In oh. fact, I haven't seen anything about Bo Burnham. Dude, you, are, you need to do yourself a favor. <laughs> oh, man. If you like like musical and comedy, I like oh. that. He is... Oh. Remember that boss he fought? Let's do it. I'm super happy about this. At least they're but, not, like, boss bar, uh... No. But, yeah, there's much HP as they can. But, my god, like, inside is something special, because it's a comedy, and it, it's amazing how you walk away from it not feel... I don't mean this in a bad way, it's a good thing, I highly recommend it, but you don't walk away from this comedy special feeling, like, lighter and giggly, you walk away feeling kind of sad. <laughs> but I, I definitely recommend it. it I mean, it, what's the difference between a comedy and a tragedy? Um, who's laughing? <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good answer. Uh, <laughs> dark, but yes. I think the original, uh, the original concept behind a comedy and a tragedy was in a tragedy. Uh, it ends. There's still laughter, but like, it ends with everybody dying or the main characters dying or something like that. And in a comedy, um, people can die, but it won't be the main characters. Something like that. I forget what it is, but the Shakespearean uh, concept behind it. But, yeah. Um, for people who haven't seen it, we'll go into it a little bit. Like, it's, he filmed this entire special inside one room. Um, and it, like, lit, but still manages to make it really interesting and, and colorful and just overall phenomenal. I highly, highly recommend it, especially if, you, if you've seen his previous work and you like Bill Burnham. He has three specials on Netflix, and all of them are great. Are you plugging Bo Burnham right now? Yes! <laughs> I love, uh, honestly, I'm like, dude's like, I'm a, kind of like a, I want to say Carlin, I don't know if that's giving too much credit. Oh my god, did you <laughs> die? There you go. Anyway. Uh, and more. Oh, oh, fuck, I don't like these things. So. They don't stagger either, like. They just bounce back, it's annoying. I want you to like, stay here so I can keep hitting you. Isn't it I think it's funny that the stalls in the back are the same shape as the helmets that they're wearing. Implying that their stalls and heads are actually the shape of the, uh... <laughs> Wait, that's not the shape of your head? Oh, I didn't realize I could get one stuck on my head. <laughs> I'm dead. Oh, boy. It's like the Americans that think, uh, we all have floppy heads. I... Oh, because it's out there? Yeah. <laughs> oh, fl okay. I didn't understand what you meant. I was very confused. Hey, oh, Paul! Hey, that's what, buddy! <laughs> I'm gonna go eat some cock and I. Yeah, let's think poop song. I'm not your buddy, guy. I'm not your guy, friend. I'm not your friend, buddy. I'm not your buddy, guy. <laughs> this is one of the easiest ones. Yeah, I've noticed. Especially compared to the last one, which was like a load of crap. Uh-huh. <laughs> this one's a load of crap. <laughs> <laughs> I do hate the bats, so they like stop. Whoa! I just took 93 damage from this. Oh, his tongue. Okay, his tongue actually does a lot of damage. So I'm dead. Oh, smash it! Smash it! I don't even have a fucking uh, potion anymore. Yeah, I'm not supposed to. Well, I only got three. I have to buy five. And we're done again. Two up. Yeah. Well, this is a bad time. <laughs> I'm apparently not allowed to do anything. <laughs> no. So, uh, don't. Are you enjoying this game? It's a fun game. It is a fun game. It's not bad. I feel like it would be easier to play on, like, one player. Yeah. Let, let me be honest about something here. Um, and I think a lot of people are going to agree with me on this who actually have colorblindness. I do. Nintendo. I'm going back to Nintendo here. They do really good at making games 
that everybody can see without having any issues on four player simultaneous mode. The yep. only one that I would argue with that's a little bit hard to see is Super Smash Brothers, and they don't directly make that game. So, honestly, I, I'm not colorblind. I'm generally pretty good with color, I, but I do find, despite that, it's really easy to lose yourself with like everything going on on this map. In this game, in general, I mean. Yeah, it's. it's I think this was originally an indie game. It just took off. Well, it was a flash game. Was it a flash game? Yeah. Oh, this existed on, like, a browser? Yes, so it was way back when uh, Newgrounds, I believe, was starting to take off. Uh, there was a Castle Cat Crasher Splash game, and it was only a couple levels, and then the uh, the ones that made it ended up remaking it for uh, the awesome. newer generation, yeah. That's awesome, because this game, uh, I've been playing it since much younger, much younger, and to this day, I still like to play it with my friends. I played the... Uh, the That's really fun. Flash version of this game. So he can use his tongue when he's above the foot. At first, I thought we were actually doing really good against this guy because his health bar was dropping like really fast, but uh. I didn't realize he could hold his tongue back. I thought it was programmed to just attack. God, that does a lot of damage. I need to you definitely want to be blocked no, 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 no. like that, by the way. Yeah, I, I need to start investing in uh, defense. Because uh, my health, I think I only have 100 health, and he has 89 damage. Oh, yeah, he sure does. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah. So he is a pet. Alright, okay. Yeah, boy! The, the the other those knights there can also take that one. Oh, that is annoying. Do you level up? That's a level. That's all the stuff you gathered in that playthrough. Nice. Anywho, we should definitely buy some um, potions. I agree. Yeah, and maybe start investing in uh, defense. I know. Better. I immediately said that, and I was like, oh, I'm gonna buy. I'm not gonna do that. Gotta use my scissor blade to defeat the evil threads. I don't remember anything about that show. <laughs> you guys ever watch Spider Rider growing up? No. Why does that sound familiar? It was on Teletoon, and it was like an American anime. And it was, it was, in my opinion, I loved it. It, it was discontinued. They stopped it. Uh, I don't think they ever reached a conclusion. But it was like dudes riding on giant spiders, mechanical spiders. And that was the coolest thing in my mind, because like... I don't know, I really liked the, the whole concept of the show. But I feel like because they brought it onto a cartoon... ...website that, uh, it was, it was ahead of its time, in my opinion, because it was totally in it. It wasn't like a cartoon, it was in I mean, if we're going to talk about old shows that were really good and deserve a comeback, let's talk Reboot. Not the crappy <laughs> uh, show that came out on Netflix. That was a really good show. Honestly, of all the shows that I feel like they need to, to bring back and expand some, Cyber Six was a really interesting show. Oh, oh female Batman? Sort of, yeah. She didn't totally jump on the horses. Nope, I want it back. There was a lot of shows back then that were really good. I kind of wish they do a remake of the uh, the Gummy Bears, uh, where the Ducktales remake was actually or reboot was really good. I like Ducktales. Uh, I think most people did. It, it barely. They, I don't think they very, very made made very many episodes of it. They're on two seasons. I think they're in the process of making a third season right now. Actually, it's a very good uh, reboot. One note, one note, it's not a good reboot. Oh, okay. We mentioned it a little bit earlier. Powerpuff Girls reboot. Oh. <laughs> Specifically the live action TV show that they were thinking about making. I didn't yeah, know that it. was a thing. Yeah. It was pretty much porn. Yeah. Uh, but, but they're children. I no, 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 this is when they're supposed to be grown up. This is like them like in college age or something like that. 
Oh, did they still have the fucked up hands? Because <laughs> no, it's canonically action, that it's, was actually a thing. It's with real people. Yeah, no, this is straight up like they were like, uh, we are gonna make a show about the girls after they've grown up and they have to deal with. Let um, me get off. Yeah, good job. But, uh, yeah, no, like, that that's especially messed up because, like, canonically, they did, in fact, have the messed up hands. Yeah, because everybody else did. No, it was, no, everyone else had normal no, hands. I, yeah, that's what I meant. And they even acknowledged mm -hmm. it. They're straight like, what's with their hands? I... Mojo Jojo. <laughs> yeah, Mojo Jojo. That's all I have hands. <laughs> My brain was slipping out. Wait, is that thing he says? Yes, that's why his brain is in that jar on the top of his head. Oh, right, right. It's, it's in his origin episode. I forgot about um, his whole... I never watched that much. Mm -hmm. Wasn't Satan like a character in that? No. no it was some red dude. Okay, like, so Satan. No, no it wasn't actually <laughs> Satan. It was like some weird dude. Very strange character, but not, not quite literally Satan. Well, just trans. Yeah, let's make that comparison. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it was a male voice was a... Uh, you know what? I don't even want to get into this conversation because as much as I, I, I'm like a so it totally acceptance... To say, uh, I have acceptance for everybody. I just don't want to piss anybody off the by the way I'm it? talking about this. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I, I, I guess to be specifically, like, we support everyone's identity and, and however... You know, your struggles and... You know what I mean. Yeah. <laughs> LGBTQ plus... Uh, proud and all that fun stuff. What a cartoon I love. What cartoon? Danny Phantom. That was a good show that had a lot of potential to be... Great. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't know why it was discontinued. I think there was just... Miscommunication. There is an amazing clip, and I don't know what show it's from. I I've never watched it... But uh, they got Jonathan, what's his last name, from Corn, to come in and do the voice of this cactus bad guy. And the whole skit, which lasts about two or three minutes, is just them all kind of singing old songs. I, like they even do like um, uh, chop suey. Like they'll ask a question, be like, "He wanted to. Why are you attacking the city?" Because he wanted to, <laughs> and it's it's really great. You, you gotta no look idea. it out. <laughs> I'll show you when we pause. It's so good. All right. Um, well, we're gonna pause so we can show us this. Uh, talk to you later, maybe lunatics. We'll be. I guess we're maybe lunatics. You're lunatics. All of you are crazy. Bye bye. <laughs>